because I should make it better. Wait, wait, wait. You're happy, right? Yes. You're happy. Why are you so, like... So like, what? You're so mean, like, you now. No, like... That's not true, Joey. I'm happy. I've been happy for a very long time. So I don't, I don't think so. You don't? No. Because if you were happy, you would want to be a beautiful family. We didn't keep you out of the family. You kept us out of the family. This is your blood. I did. And, and Jennifer I made did. fun of him, and you chimed no. in. But your behavior that night was a little bitch girl. I'm a, I'm a bitch now. I'm a bitch boy. Sorry, you are. You chimed in. Yeah. Like, what are you talking about? You're embarrassing. She called you I'm a bitch boy, low. but Joe, you're playing it real well. Ah, shut up. I met you in months, and you f***ed me. Come on, man. Shut the f*** up. But we're so unhappy, we're going to go get therapy. Go, go get therapy. You should, because then maybe we could be a happy family. We became the biggest disappointment in life. You could change that. You could change that. Thank you, honey. The matriarch of our family. Poor oh Melissa. God. This is the problem with Joe and Melissa. It's like any opportunity they have to try to make Teresa look bad, they almost double down on it. Back up. I'll, I'll, I'll guide you. If I would have asked Melissa to be in my wedding, that means I would have been happy. I'm not going to put you in my wedding if you're trashing me. No, no, And no. Melissa puts on a sweet, pretty little face and gets away with it. OK, but you know what they say? Beware of the wolf in sheep's clothing. I just, you know, Teresa likes to act like she's a changed person, but like my therapist told me, if you pretend it doesn't exist, you never move forward. Yeah. yeah, no, and you know what? I, I have to be honest, I was really mad to hear that you guys were all talking sh about my brother last night. Because when I talked to you guys at your house, Jen, it was so honest. What was the demise of your relationship? So I had blocked him on social media because he was making fun of me, and he lost his mind. He's like, I want you out of my wedding, and that was it. That's it. Like... And that should have been good enough for each one of you. I just didn't understand. You blocked him on social media, they say, guess what, sister? Done, disowned. Yeah, crazy. If that's what actually happened, that's cuckoo. But it is. I know what it takes to get to that point where I wouldn't even bother anymore. That's why it didn't make any sense. But that's what you're reaching for. You're like, oh, she had to do something. Maybe the sister-in-law. Maybe there's a problem there. Don't even go there. I blocked him on Instagram, and he called me like a raving maniac. Period, period, period. Good Just wondering what the rest of the story that is. That is the story. No, I think you know. Say it. Shut the up. Oh. Why do I have to be villainized in yeah, this situation? Why, it, why, why can't it just be I don't think they're villainized. Everybody's villainized in your Danielle for real. Who the f wants to be friends with people like that? I don't. I got very hurt. I'm done explaining myself. I'm, I'm, done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Thank you. I'm done. I'm finished. Danielle. Don't leave. Don't leave. I'm going to go. I'm just I'm done. I can't. Danielle's a drama queen. I don't understand being pissed because people are asking questions. Danielle, I know. I'm done. Okay. I don't think I could possibly be more hurt by what's going on in my family life. But what they're coming at me with is so heartbreaking. I'm okay. done. That's ridiculous. Like I give a f They're trying to pull me out as a liar, which is everything I am not. It would have hurt me less if he would have just sucker punched me right in the face. I'm just done explaining myself to everybody. Yeah.